a man who literally has um, skin infections playing a game of risk on his face. Steve Bannon is here to tell us the military side of things. This is the military strategist. Um, I'm sure we will hear things like tip of the spear, crack of my ass, stuff like that. Also, do you want a free gift watch for Donald Trump? Like, was Donald Trump a better president? Free gift for all who answer, and it's a Donald Trump make America great again watch. All we He's need is your email. Impeached. You do understand we're going to win 40 or 50 or 60 seats. He's getting impeached. We're impeaching him. Number one on the... Oh, and he's talking about Joe Biden, just in case you're thinking that there's they're still post to impeaching Donald Trump. Also not happening. Yes, the armor piercing shell. Thanks. What and and other uh key military phrases. And border. Signal and noise. Okay. Number two on this fiasco right now in the Ukraine. And we're gonna get into every detail of every right. penny his family stole out of there from the Ukrainian people. From <laughs> yes. Every penny that he was paid, that Hunter was paid by Burisma, which is a private company that was completely corrupt and then isn't anymore. And now uh, Putin's so pissed that the government and the companies there aren't uh, corrupt, aren't completely overrun by Russian sock puppets, that he now has to roll in with tanks to fix it. This is exactly how... Uh, uh, Putin expected to have to deal with this problem. He wasn't expecting, um, uh, you know, Trump to hand it to him. Uh, sorry, yes, I I mispronounced the name of the company. What was the what was the name of the company again? I'm the sure. Burmese executives. So this uh, Burmese, Burmese, they say pronounce it Burmese. Um. Yeah. Kleptocrats in Ukraine that were his partners. We're going to get to the, the, the kleptocrats that were his partners that are no longer in charge in Ukraine. Oddly, after Biden was vice president and and uh, Hunter worked at Burisma or worked with uh, Rosemont Seneca uh, guiding whatever investment foreigners were making into that to make sure their money was spent on actual gas pipelines instead of funneled to Russia like it had before, because that's basically what he was there for. That's that's what that's why Rosemont Seneca was there. That's why, by the way, the Biden name was part of the reason why people were willing to invest because they knew that Hunter would not run off to Russia with the money the way the other investor groups had after because they're trying to undermine the oil and gas industry in Ukraine and and through subterfuge destroy the entire government. That's that was Putin's initial plan. It didn't work. He still blames Biden for that. Trump came in. And just like, yeah, I'll let you, I'll let you have it. I'll recognize. I mean, it's basically Crimea is yours anyways. It's really Russian territory. I mean, they speak, right? That is the same thing, whatever. And then he was supposed to win again and then hand it over and, uh, sad. Every penny to the fifth decimal place of everything the Clintons and. Every penny to the fifth decimal place. You only have five decimal places, uh, in terms of pennies. When uh, you're you're talking about incremental um, gains from, say, stock gains or dividends, that's the way it breaks down a lot of times. Um, and I guess to the penny, whatever. Anyways, uh, you only have that when people are making money off investments. Biden and these corrupt Democrats have 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 taken off the skimmed off the top. Yes, that's what they were doing. Not like Paul Manafort, who was uh, putting snipers in fucking clock towers while he was working for uh, the, the Russian sock puppet, the previous president of Russia, before the Euromaidan, and telling those people like, yeah, blow the heads off of produ uh, of uh, protesters. See, the, and, and you know, quite frankly, in, in Greg Kelly's book, that many was tough and a good leader. And now you see it right there. Where's all the tough talk? Where, where's, where's Joe Biden? Where's his tough talk? Um, he's given like two speeches in the last day and they put the biggest sanctions on Russia that they've ever had. And they're still giving them room in case they stop, but it doesn't look like they're going to. So they're going to continue to put the sanctions on. Yeah. Fucking Joe. They called your bluff, dude. Called your bluff. Oh, is it, oh, is it his bluff or is it America's bluff? Unless you're, you're saying we should send troops in. You're saying go forward further. That's, that's what you're saying. We should, we should. Uh, send in American uh, men and women to fight this. 
That's, that's what it is. And you're sitting there with no face cards. You're not paying for it. You're sitting up here in 16 Pennsylvania. Your son's running around. Hey, asshole, you're a block and a half away from Pennsylvania Avenue. You're sitting in front of a, a, a gas fireplace in an apartment you've turned into a podcasting studio. Tough guy. Jesus Christ, at least I know I'm being silly. In art galleries selling that crap he calls art, that pornography he calls art? <laughs> pornography? I got to see some of this stuff. I, I thought it was just kind of splatter art. It looked like, uh, um, what, what's the spirograph? That's what it looked like to me. You want to see, you want to see the Biden family? You want to know everything you want to know about the Biden family? Sure. Go, go to Jack Maxey's Twitter account. Just, just see the lap, read Miranda Devine's book and go to Jack Maxey's site or, or call, contact Jack Maxey. Yeah. Do I have to call? Do you have his number? Do you want to put it on the screen? What the Tech fuck? Jack Maxey, DM him on Twitter. Yeah, yeah, I'll I'll talk to him. Jack Maxey, yeah, Jack and Jack and I are, you know, you you and Jack are like this. Yeah, I know. Who? Jack Maxey walk you through the laptop from hell because Jack will. Uh, I'm sorry, there is no laptop. There Ooh, is no Hunter Biden laptop. Social. Prove me wrong. Show it. Show it. Get it from Rudy. Hold it up. Wave it around. Let me see it. Where's the metadata? Don't talk to me about somebody who's gotten printouts from Rudy Giuliani and looked at it and like, it looks real to me. Fuck off. There is no Hunter Biden laptop. Go away. There are more pictures of Rudy Giuliani having lunch with Russians than there are pictures of that laptop. There are lots of them with Rudy having lunch with Russians. There are zero fucking pictures of the laptop, much less the metadata from it. And God knows I can find a laptop and slap a Bo Biden Foundation sticker on it that I print up on a fucking laser printer. That doesn't mean it exists. Oh, yeah. You come for the pornography and you stay for the compromise. That's why I watch your show. Sure. What? Disgusting, revolting, revolting. And then it's disgusting, revolting, revolting. It's good. It's, I mean, uh, now uh, while we're talking about your skin, um, <laughs> Who put a mirror in front of Steve Bannon? Revolting. Revolting. And there the Chinese Communist Party's paying them off left and right. But that's after they sucked as much money out of the Ukraine as they can. Remember, this is what Putin called your bluff. He says, hey, you've turned the Ukraine into a colony, a Clinton colony. A Clinton, Clinton colony? Wait, a, hold on. A Clinton colony? I thought Clinton was actually spying on behalf of the Russians. Right? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm going to need, can you please call Glenn Beck or someone and get a fucking chart up on the wall? I am going to need some push pins and some pictures and some red thread going from each one. He stole as much money as they could out of Haiti, out of sub-Saharan Africa, and then they're in Ukraine, stealing it with both hands. With Well, I mean, obviously, I mean, the money isn't worth that much, so you're going to want, you're going to want both hands. Uh, full <laughs> both hands. Mm -hmm. In the day, uh, you know, the, the day of judgments yeah. here. And we're, we're all the tough talkers. Are they taking incomings from Putin? Or, or incomings. Yes, you're taking incomings from Putin right about here. Are, are they sitting there sheltering in place? Are they preparing for impact? You're <laughs> and other military phrases? Where's all the tough talk that I put? Uh, by the way. You have a picture of Jesus behind you. Just saying. Also a getter hat. Where's no love for truth social? I'm still at 176,000 on the waiting list. Nothing. Your, your polling is now in the teens among independents is going to single digits. You think? You're getting impeached. You won't be thrown out of office. You won't be removed from office because there's not enough uh, spine in the Oh, oh, I see. Now, it, when when Trump's getting impeached and the Senate won't uh, follow through, it's because uh, um, he's innocent. But if if Biden gets impeached by Republicans in the House and they don't throw him out, it's because there's a lack of spine. Right? Party in the Senate to throw you out to get the votes. But you are getting impeached or at least. Also, who the fuck does he does this asshole actually think he's talking to Joe Biden? Do you know how much, like, ridiculous ego it would take? Like, I have a fairly strong level of self-confidence. Believe you me. Uh, I, I, I have 
no shortage of ego on my part. But at no point am I like turning to, because I'll talk to the clips as if they're there, just mainly for entertainment's sake between you and I. But I don't actually expect most of these assholes, some of the YouTubers, they'll check in because they're egomaniacs. But if I was like, listen, Joe Biden, <laughs> like, can you imagine, can you imagine talking to the screen going, all right, listen here, Vladimir Putin. Yeah, you may think you're all that in a bag of chips, son. <laughs> Fuck off. Counts. And I can't wait for the you, you, the Trump on a perfect phone call. They spent weeks and weeks and weeks and all the guys on MSNBC. Uh, a perfect phone call. If it was a perfect phone call, it wouldn't have even been able to be misunderstood as being criminal, even though it was actively criminal. Also, only 789 rumbles. I mean, it's got 6,000 views. But only 789 rumbles? Is that does that count as a rumble ratio? I I I'd look it up, but I don't give a fuck. They impeach them all up there. They're all up there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Vinman they're up there. and that whole crowd, Doing Fiona Hill, Vinman, all of them speaking that nonsense. Yeah, speaking that nonsense. Joy and Reed. The white supremacy. Joy Ann Joy Ann Reed, yeah. Remember when Joy Ann Reed testified in the Trump administration in the Trump uh Impeachment trial? The fuck? This is all you care about. All you care, the Atlantis is all they care about is themselves in Europe. It's yeah, that's all they care about. The, the America and Europe. Weird. That's not fair. I mean, we obviously care a lot about Mexico and, and Canada and Japan, and South Korea and Taiwan and Hong Kong and Australia, obviously, or we wouldn't have given them nuclear-powered submarines, something Trump could have done, but never did. That's weird. Big world out there. What about it taking is. down the Chinese Communist Party? What about freeing the, the, the slave labor of the Chinese people and breaking, oh, if we Yeah, that's a good question. Why didn't Trump ever do that? It's odd. Why did he sell them the largest order of beef, corn, soybeans, and pork in our nation's history did, in the middle of the Uyghur controversy? Right as that was... That story was, I mean, getting a solid anchor. That's weird. Also, I'm sorry, but how is it that I managed to freeze frame and make you look worse? Did that will you break the business model of the party of Davos? Also, is it is is your bullshit written on the ceiling, Steve? Uh uh See see how that makes you look like you're you're just kind of pulling it out of your ass? Like uh, uh. <laughs> World Economic Forum wouldn't make as much money then. I got it. That's why we don't do it. We do, okay, got it. Understand it. And they're also Asian. They're Chinese. They don't count. They don't count. But but in Davo you what? What is this ramble? Yeah, let's. Yeah, we should invade uh, China over the Uyghurs and and take back our beef that Trump sold them first. Switzerland, that all counts. In Brussels, that all counts. In Cambridge, mm -hmm. that all counts. Up there with Harvard, right? Up in New York City, that all counts. Washington, D.C. Yeah, it's all that. Also, cities. Toledo, that all counts. There's a um, uh, Chattanooga. It doesn't count. But I, I do like saying it, though, because it's one of the it's the funnest city name to say, I think. Chattanooga. Joanne Reed, what are you doing? You're, 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 ta ta you're yeah, all you're doing yeah, is talking yeah, to white yeah, supremacists. Yeah, yeah. That's all it is. Yeah, 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 that's what all you're doing. Disgusting, revolting, and look who's paying. Yes, yes. Uh, again, what, does anybody understand what the fuck is being said here? I mean, is this is this just like a crash of like whataboutism and self hatred? Just bashing into themselves inside this man's empty dome is is this the ramblings of that melanoma on his fucking temple S bannon i don't like you i think you're awful get that checked see i don't even wish death on somebody as scummy as you scum you filth scum and scum scum revolting revolting Get it checked, asshole. I feel like it's talking to me like like uh um like I'm afraid it's gonna open its arms and go, Quaid. Where's tough talking Joe Biden? Is Hunter Biden over there today? Is Hunter Biden over there with his business partners? He's sitting there with the Ukraine flag. Where's Hunter? 
Is he? I hear. I'm the good thing is I'm glad you're not um fighting old battles you've lost multiple times because that would that would be a waste. Dark Gary is he with more strippers? Is he doing more? Is he smoking more? Uh, I don't know. You'll have to ask Mike Lindell if he's smoking more crack. Uh, yeah, again, that's I, you're going to have to ask Mike Pillow. Yeah, Quato. That's right. We, we have na- we have officially named that on Steve Bannon's head, Quato. Steve, fuck, dude, get it checked. It's gross, and it it's going to kill you. Being sincere right now, I fucking can't stand you, and I think you should be in jail. But I don't wish skin cancer on anyone. Barf, barf. With more and more, you know, the, the, in the uh, don't trust, uh, uh, don't uh, ask uh, me. Go, uh, go uh, to the, go to the, know, go to the go laptop. To the, oh, that was yeah, go, Russian disinformation. Yeah. No, we proved that was. A- Sorry. Uh, yes, it was. What laptop? You know Rudy Giuliani personally. What laptop? Where is it? Where is the laptop? Where is the laptop tour? Where is the? Where have they gone? Do, uh, fucking on the. You don't think they couldn't go on a laptop stadium tour? Rudy Giuliani touring around with the Hunter Biden laptop and a big fucking projector. Here's what we found on a clickety clack. This is a person that we've hired. Yeah. I? To like, they're, they're, we don't, I don't know this person. They're going to type on it and break into it and shut it. Get out. Yes. I have the, I have the Hunter Biden laptop. I also have Rudy's ex wife's laptop that was behind the, um, the couch when they raided his apartment. Disgusting. Absolutely disgusting, disgusting and horrible, revolting. Horrible, disgusting, revolting, revolting, and horrible and slut. And she's a slut, slut. So we, we so what you're saying is it's revolting. Steve, for somebody who was uh, pardoned by the President of the United States, so he wouldn't have to spend time in jail. You seem a little uh, anxious, considering. You know what I mean? Seem a, seem a little grumpy there, pal. Also, more bloated than usual. I don't know if you're stress eating, or it's the gin. It's the gin. It's the, it's the gin. Wait, that's it? Yeah, that's the end of the clip. Just revolting, revolting, cut. <laughs> Ugh. All right. For the, for the record, uh, to any if anybody who goes to that uh, Twitter feed of the dude that he recommends to go figure out what he's gotten from printouts that Rudy Giuliani gave him for the fucking laptop to but whatever, go there and tell tell them to have Steve Bannon go to a dermatologist fucking yesterday. <laughs> 